Today we're going to look at how to remove and replace the comfort liner and neck protector in the F15 structural firefighting helmet. During fires your helmet may become soiled with chemical, biological and particulate hazards. This may affect the performance, longevity and comfort of your helmet. You are also putting your health at risk if the comfort liner and neck protector is not cleaned regularly. The comfort liner and neck protector on an F15 structural firefighting helmet can be removed and replaced in under 10 minutes. The neck protector attaches at four points around the edge of the chassis. The tabs pull out towards the inside of the helmet. Hold on to the first tab and pull it down. Repeat the process for the remaining three tabs. The headband on an F15 can be removed without the need for specialised tools. The headband is attached to the liner in four positions, two at the front and two at the rear. Grip the first attachment point firmly and pull upwards to release. Repeat the process on the remaining three attachment points. The rear comfort pad is fastened with hook and loop. Remove the rear comfort pad by releasing the hook and loop. Unhook the front comfort pad or air mesh from the headband. We like to start on the top at the front of the headband then work our way around. Once the front comfort pad or air mesh is removed, the foam padding will come loose. We recommend a technical detergent like Citro Squeeze for cleaning the helmet's soft components. Citro Squeeze effectively attaches to and removes hydrocarbons. Replace your comfort pads with a clean set. This time we're starting at the bottom row of hooks on the sides of the headband. Insert the foam padding and hold against the front of the headband while you hook the comfort pad back on. Continue with the top row of hooks on the sides of the headband. When you come to the front of the headband, we recommend you start with the tabs at the bottom. They will need to be passed through the slots of the headband, as shown. Make sure all the fabric tabs have been looped over a hook and the comfort padding is secure. Replace the back comfort pad using the hook and loop fastening. The wider side of the pad should be facing up as shown.
slip the headband back into the liner using the four anchor points. Rip the ribbon firmly and press down until you hear it click into place. Repeat with the other three anchor points. The neck protector attaches at four points around the edge of the chassis. The tabs push in towards the outside of the helmet. A full range of spare parts is available from Packfire. You can shop online by going to packfire.com.au, clicking on helmets and then spare parts. All of the products mentioned or used in this video are linked in the description box below. We recommend carrying out a routine clean after every incident. You should also consider advanced cleans on your helmet by an approved managed service facility like Packcare. Thanks for watching and don't forget to like, comment and subscribe to our channel.